All right. There we go. Now the house has popped up. It's night time in Odd Hole Glades, so I think none of the shops will be open right now. Which really stinks, because we kind of need the shops for some stuff. I'm going to have to start going through all the shops in the game now, before we go to the arena, which is one of the next quests we're going to end up doing. And I'm going to have to buy a ton of will potions for the arena, because the arena is pretty... ridic. Yes, we're going to rent it out. We're not going to invest any upgrades in this one. I think the upgrades don't actually do anything to affect the renting price. So we're just going to leave that as is. Hmm. Nothing interesting in there. Do some quick searching around. Oh, treasure chest. I don't think I've ever gotten this treasure chest. I don't even know what's in here. Chainmail boots. Boots. Do we have the chainmail set? We might have the chainmail set here. Um. Chainmail suit. Three out of five pieces, so we're lacking the chest piece and the helm. Hmm. Okay. If I could remember where to get those, I'd almost go get them. Hmm. But anyway, as of now, let's go ahead and head back to the guild. I might do some quick investigating before we continue. Because I'm not really sure how the arena works on heroic mode. And I think I might have to stick my foot in and see exactly how many mana potions I'm going to need for it. So that'll be a thing. But before I go do that, we're going to grab some level ups. See if there's anything we can buy. Um, let's go ahead and take toughness, because I think that might stack with physical shield. Maybe. Possibly. And then speed level 5, we can definitely buy and use. And then I think that'll be good for now. Can't think of anything else that we really need that's pressing at the moment. Um, Multi-strike level 2, we could probably buy that. Yep. So that's good enough to buy. Alright. That's everything we can need for now. So, with all of that in mind, I'm going to take a quick save, and I'm going to look into how the arena works, and then I'll come back and give you my findings. Because as I said, I'm trying to make this a bit of an um, optimization playthrough. I'm not trying to be a moron completely all the time, but we'll see. We'll see how this works. All right, I did my quick run of the arena just to uh, test the waters, and it's a lot easier than I thought it was going to be, actually. I had plenty of health or uh, mana potions to get really far into it, so we're going to take the quest and boast. I won't do this with any other quests. This was just something special, because the arena is something I don't want to mess up. You can get a lot of money from it, and if you do it correctly, you're set for the rest of the game. So we're going to boast without a scratch. We're going to boast Merciful Hero. And that basically means we have to take Mercy on as many foes as, foes as possible. Whenever we are given the chance to take Mercy on a foe, we must do so. And I'm going to end up doing that anyway. It's kind of a spoiler that it's a boast, which is dumb. I don't know why they did that. But whatever. Uh, regardless, we are ready to go to the arena. And... I was really assuming it would be way harder than it was. So I will go ahead and show you what it's going to be like. Honestly, looking back, I kind of wish I'd just straight up done it. But, um... I'm trying to be slightly professional about this. You know? Just, just want to make sure I do everything without making major mistakes. So that was needed. Anyway, let's go ahead and head to the arena. We need con to conserve as many will potions as possible, so we're going to ignore anything blocking our path on the road on the way there. Even though I had a surplus of will potions, as it turned out, after the fact. 
Um, I don't want to take any chances, and I want to use as many, uh, or as little will as I, possible in this uh, entire process. Because we have to keep our physical shield running through the entire arena. And I do the entire arena without taking breaks. It gives you the option after every round, because this is basically what it is, is it's like a giant death match. You fight enemies and waves. I can't believe that. You come into spec to participate, eh? Well, got it. You, you've already got one. Yep. All right, we are ready to enter the arena, and um, there will be an NPC that sort of explains how it works, so I won't talk over him. This way, please. One out of two, or bleh, two out of two boats. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble talking today. Ugh. Bleh. Welcome to the Hall of Heroes. If you follow me, I'll take you to the arena preparation area. I tell you, the history of this place is wasted on the public. The arena's first heroes, our land's heritage. But do people care? Nah. People don't want history, they want the heroes of today. Still, I suppose every era needs its own heroes. Hmm, quite profound that. You can quote me if you like. Welcome to the Witchwood Arena. A couple of basic points first. First of all, I must remind you to keep your aggression for the arena itself. Anyone caught trying to cut up his rivals in here will be in trouble. You have been warned. Secondly, the way out. You can come in after each round, not during a round. Ralph, it's getting really ugly out there. All right, you, Chameleon, you've heard all this before. Go on for the first round and keep the crowd happy. No problem, this'll be easy. Okay, when it's your turn, I'll call your name and you will enter the arena through the door our friend Chameleon just used. Once in the arena, you will battle foes from all over Albion. Every group of creatures you defeat wins your prize money and increases the prize for the next round. The aim is to stay out there as long as you can to earn the big gold. Now, you can come back here anytime you like to buy potions or more equipment. Do this though and your price for the next round will be zero. And worse, the crowd will think you're a big loser. Real heroes get out there and stay out there. Whether you rest or not, the arena bonus prize, given by Jack of Blades himself, will go to whoever gets through every single round alive. So, get out there. Use your skills well, make sure the crowd enjoys it, and if you have to die, do so bravely. The rest of you, wait your turn. We are going to get out there and stay out there. I have never needed to rest during the arena. Uh, your lordship, so, lordship by all. first of all, the arena shop is really good. <laughs> they have a special offer for every you, single kind of gear in the game we could possibly want. So we're going to buy the entire plate set while we're here. Because we can afford it, funny enough. I wasn't sure if we'd be able to afford it because I thought they'd jack the prices up on it. But as it turns out, we can barely afford it. So we'll get... All this, and then we're going to go over to the potions and buy the maximum of potions. You killed the legendary white. And now, let's go to our equipment and equip that full set of armor we just purchased. And we look flippin' amazing. Full plate armor and a pimp hat. Oops. Yeah. Uh -huh. We are ready to go. I don't want this. Oh. Okay. Hey! We're gonna have to activate Stand physical shield, us. and we're going to keep it on the entire time we're out there. Which means we have a very limited stock of potions we can drive through. Oh. The two waves that are going to give me trouble <laughs> are going this. to be waves, I think, uh, three Jack? and five. So I'm gonna have to really watch those two uh, waves. Uh -huh. <laughs> the first one being the Balverine wave and the second one being the bandit wave, but I kind of figured out a strategy midway through the arena for um, Doing it a little easier and taking the pressure off yourself. So I'll try to employ that as well uh, Ross bad news. I think chameleons, uh, you know dead what already the idiot right people 
It seems Chameleon only made it through three rounds before dying like a chicken in front of 5,000 people. We need a new volunteer. New man, you look ready. In you go. Talk to Al up by the door. He'll let you into the arena. Okay, Al. Let me in. I'm ready to do this. Right. I can let you in now. You sure you're ready? Ready, steady, go. Ah, uh, round one. They always tell me this one gives them the biggest, uh, buzz. Buzz. <laughs> That's a good one, Al. Buzz. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> <laughs>